So we can change the size of most front panel objects. When we move the positioning tool over a resizable object, resizing handles appear at the points where we can resize the object. When we resize an object, the font size remains the same. And if we have a group of objects, resizing a group of objects resizes all the objects within the group. Some objects change size only horizontally or vertically when we resize them, such as digital numeric controls and indicators. Others keep the same proportions when we resize them, such as knobs. The positioning cursor appears the same, but the dashed border that surrounds the object moves in only one direction. So we can manually restrict the growth direction when we resize an object. To restrict the growth vertically or horizontally or to maintain the current proportion of the object, press the shift key while we click and drag the resizing handles. So if I press shift key, and then drag but if I don't press shift key and just drag To resize an object around its center point, press the control key while we click and drag the resizing handles. So I am now pressing the control key and now dragging. To restrict the growth vertically or horizontally or to maintain the current proportions of the object and to resize an object around its center point, press the control shift keys while we click and drag the resizing handles. So now I am holding control shift and then dragging this object, its handles.
To resize multiple objects to the same size, select the objects and select Resize Objects pull down menu on the toolbar. We can resize all the selected objects to the width or height of the largest by choosing maximum width. maximum height maximum width and height minimum width minimum height minimum width and height and we can resize all the selected objects to a specific size in pixels by choosing this option. Here we can either apply width since only the width is applicable on numeric controls then in this in that case width uh, of 54 would be used or we can specify a width of our own. And also we can see the width of the objects, selected objects. If we add a splitter bar, To the front panel and create panes, we can select different objects on multiple panes by using the shift key and selecting the objects that we want to resize. 